Lesson 5.8, Number Pairs to 5, we introduce the word sum and equation. In this lesson, we model and write addition sentences for number pairs up to the sums of 5 with cube trains. We introduce the word sum and equation. The sum of an addition sentence is the total. It's the number in all. 1 plus 4, the sum is 5. It is equal to 5. 5 is the sum. We can write the sum at the end after the is equal to symbol, or we can write it in front to the left of the is equal to symbol. So we can write the sum over here, or we can write the sum over here. And it doesn't matter as long as it shows the same amount on both sides of the is equal to symbol. So this is what I mean. We have our 5 and then our is equal to symbol and then we have 3 plus 2 and 3 plus 2 is 3, 4, 5. We have a 5 on this side and we have a 5 on this side. This uses the number 5, this uses 3 plus 2 for 5. On this one our is equal to 5 is over here. We have 3 plus 2, which is 5 on this side of the is equal to sign. And we have 5 on this side. This is just showing 5 as a number pair. This is showing 5 as the number 5. And a number sentence is also called an equation. Here's the word equation. An equation shows the same amount on both sides of the is equal to symbol. We can call number sentences or addition sentences equations. They are addition equations. So this is just a different way to write a number sentence. We can write it with the total in all and then the equal sign, or we can write the number pairs, then an equal sign, and the total in all. We can use two different colors and a cube train to show 3 is equal to 1 plus 2. We can take one red counter and two blue counters and it will be equal to 3. We can write it with the sum on this side is equal to 1 plus 2. Or we can write 1 plus 2 is equal to 3 with the sum on that side. We can also show 3 by using 2 red and 1 blue. 3 is equal to 2 plus 1, or we can write 2 plus 1 is equal to 3. And all of these addition equations are true because both sides of the is equal to symbol show the same amount. They show 3. Here we have cube trains, and they all have 4. Different number pairs can be used for the same sum. All of these have the sum 4. We can use the number pair 0 red and 4 blue for 0 plus 4, that's equal to 4. Or we could do 4 red and 0 blue for 4 plus 0, that's equal to 4. We could use a 1 and 3 for 1 plus 3 is equal to 4. We could turn it around and do 3 red and 1 blue for 3 plus 1 is equal to 4. We can even do 2 and 2 for 2 plus 2 is equal to 4. So different number pairs can be used for the same sum. These all have the same sum, 4. We just used different number pairs. Do you see how the numbers got switched around? Here it was a 1 and a 3. Here it was a 3 and a 1. Here it was a 0 and a 4, and here it was a 4 and a 0. We just switched them around. 
So remember, we can call the number in all, the total, we can call it a sum. That's the answer to an addition problem, an addition equation. An equation is a number sentence. So remember, we can write the sum to the left of the equal sign, or we could put the equal sign over here and write the sum on the right side. Our next lesson, 5.9, we're going to talk about number pairs for 6 and 7. I hope you'll join me, and I hope you have a great day. Bye.